It is Thursday, April 11, 2024. This is your midday edition of Top Stories. I am Dana Malcolm. Coming up, it is the news that matters most. There is always a savings and a smile in every aisle at Sunny Foods. With locations near you, you can shop wholesale or retail for groceries and other essentials for your home or your business. Visit Sunny Foods in Five Keys. Sunny Foods now with the Blue Hills Roundabout. Sunny Foods in Grand Turk has two locations in West Road and Back Salina. Sunny says no one beats his prices. No one. National consultation begins this week on the establishment of an independent utilities regulator for the Turks and Caicos Islands, and the process needs you. The public is invited to its special session on Thursday, April 11th, with meeting from 6 to 9 p.m. It's being held at the Palms Resort. There is also a business sector meeting on Wednesday, April 10th, from 6 to 9 p.m., also at the Palms Resort. Refreshments will be served. The energy and utilities. Utilities Department of the TCI invites you to learn about the policy and join in the consultation. Boat thieves thought to be in league with human smugglers have robbed several Turks and Caicos residents of their livelihoods. That, according to Matt Newton, acting assistant commissioner. I've recently linked in with some boat theft victims and seen firsthand the impact this is having on those owners and the significant losses they are experiencing, not only in terms of the vessels, but also the loss of business revenues. Boat tours are popular in Providenciales and many locals make their living using vessels. Newton says the police are trying to recover what they can. He was speaking during a Safeguard TCI update on April 9th. Safeguard TCI is the operation charged with protecting the country's borders from any spillover of violence in crisis-ridden Haiti. Inflation in the U.S. climbed in March more than analysts had predicted. That is according to the Bureau of Labor Statistics in the U.S. Consumers are paying 3.5% more in March than they were last year and 0.4% higher than in February. Gas prices and shelter were the most expensive areas contributing to that increase. Prices in the Turks and Caicos are subject to rise when prices in the U.S. do, as it is the country's largest trade partner. Magnetic Media is your news leader. This is an important advisory from Digicel Turks and Caicos. All Digicel subscribers whose SIM cards were issued prior to July 2021, kindly visit your nearest Digicel store and have your SIM card swapped at no cost to you. There's also dedicated SIM swap teams that will be at different locations throughout the various islands on specific days. Please look out for the communication via SMS text message. This is a telecoms commission regulatory mandate and enhances network reliability and speed. Please swap your SIM cards as soon as possible to avoid mobile service interruption. A new course, Youth on the Way to Peace and Security, is being launched in the Caribbean, targeting young people. That is according to the United Nations Development Program. The course is part of Carry Secure, which works to reduce youth involvement in crime and trafficking persons regionally. It will run from April 16th, that's next Tuesday, to the 3rd of May and will be for free. Interested young people can register for this course by Monday, April 15th at the UNDP website. With the risk of intense weather damaging utilities a constant concern, the government is looking to provide a disaster recovery trust fund for local utility providers. It would allow them to pay into a scheme that would cover uninsurable aspects of their services, allowing them to draw down on the funds in a time of need. But consumers will be expected to contribute, as utility providers will be allowed to get back that money through a levy on consumers. The DRT TF will be set up under the Multi-Sector Public Utility Regulatory Agency, according to the draft policy document, and it gives utility companies an alternative to raising prices on customers if they need to fix those uninsured damages after natural disasters, which has happened to TCI residents in the past. The Power of Attraction Magnetic Media. You can always find what you're looking for and what you need at Quality Food World. Shop retail, shop wholesale. Quality has the brands you know, the brands you love. Always quality. Big savings every day. And remember to look out for sales for even bigger savings. Open 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. Mondays through Saturdays. Open 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. on Sundays. On the Five Keys Access Road. Quality Food World, a prime trading company. 
Beaches, Turks and Caicos recently held its prestige awards to honor and reward team members who have consistently demonstrated exceptional performance and dedication. Red carpets were rolled out for everyone, but the top prize, Diamond Team Member of the Year Award, was bestowed on entertainment playmaker Enrico Lightburn. Congratulations to all winners. Indoor farming could be the key to food security, according to a new Farming UK report. They say scientists at a university in the UK are researching vertical farming, which could help produce more food on the same amount of land and reduce the environmental impact, plus avoid the future challenge presented by extreme weather events. For now, the technology is expensive and not easily accessible, but scientists are now looking at ways to reduce costs. That is it for this edition of the news. Thank you so much for joining us. Top Stories in 5 is a magnetic media production.